we're beating this today. Alright, did you create the thing? I'm not there. I'm here! God damn it. Okay. Mer okay, hear me out. Um, Sin as a boss in Ultra Kill would go hard. More sacrifice. There we go. There's a lot of modded characters in Risk of Rain 2. I bet someone could mod in Sin. What the hell was that? Okay. <laughs> yeah, no, I was like, what? what? Alright, are you ready? I mean, yeah, because it's sacrifice, but also sometimes they do, which is weird. I feel like they're not supposed to spawn, but there's something that makes them spawn. I want to say, maybe they added a bunch of bugs in the most recent update. Not even the DLC's fault. Uh, just the most recent patch. But one, they're gonna, like, fix that all, I think, according to what they've been saying recently. And also, like... I don't know, I have not encountered any. And everyone is acting. Like, you literally can't play the game without a glitch every seven seconds. And it's like... I... I encountered the particle accelerator. But that was funny. it more common and like I don't see the point in not suffering the odds of altar of gold I mean I don't see the point in not uh, getting rid of suffering I I know but it's all it's all luck based it's not like
I mean, yeah, because I'm, I'm going to be the healing guy, I think. Austin. Getting heated. I just talked about not- us not encountering that many glitches. Invincible Beetle. Its hitbox just stopped existing. Well, it wasn't. I did kill- No, that was a different beetle. I killed the Invincible Beetle. It's just that it hit- its hitbox temporarily disappeared. The healing them. Oh, damn. Dear Lord. I forget how kind of terrifying the turrets can get. Uh, do you want this one? This one? I'll open it for you, because I'm kind of... Uh... I 
I need I need to start getting some uh, soldier syringes for my poor little turrets. They're a little pathetic right now. Okay, someone who knows how to mod Risk of Rain 2. You have your task. I'm sure it wouldn't be too hard. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, I'll get a scanner. And, uh, cradles. Eggs don't show up on the, uh... Yeah. You know, I forgot until recently how just unironically good at Engineer is. I really want a, uh... A lie crystal cell. Cause that like exponent not exponentially. That like just heavily increases my uh healing capacity and damage output. It it it, it increases it by fifty percent, which doesn't sound like a lot, but that is a lot. I mean, I have infusion, so blood is fuel for me right now. Unironically, a V1 crossover mod would be so cool. I, I think they would work kinda like Void Fiend, except you choose to switch modes. So, like, uh, you would have the dash as your left bumper ability. Your right bumper ability would be switching what weapon you're using, and what weapon would ch and your weapon would change your primary and secondary abilities. Yeah, I am aware of that. Actually, I think they spawn in the final area, like, of the green portals. Like, th there are two large chests that spawn. Uh-oh! I don't- yeah, it's not a me right now. Greed is ruining the economy. I want waffle fries. I can't believe that, like, the actual voice actor made that, I'm pretty sure. Understandable. Wait, 
Alistair? Oh, okay. See, I, I was gonna say, because the original I Want Waffle Fries video is a Walton Files thing. Alright, are we going green or yellow? Understandable. Yeah, and no gesture of the drought. Is always good. Hell yeah. An equipment and then bam, a void run. Oh god. You know. Anyway, the last one is like behind this, so I'm just gonna. No, I'm aware, I just wanted to go for it. Oh, hell yeah. Why do I call it Lie Crystal? It's very obviously Lie Saint. I see. I don't know if that's ironic, because assumedly that's like what made you make the mental connection of I want waffle fries. Good ending, he got waffle fries, bad ending. I don't know, I haven't been keeping up with the Walton Files. I know something really bad happens to that guy. I, I just don't know what exactly it was. I know, I know it was bad enough that in the volume where it's introduced, his face is just entirely censored. Like, because of how bloody it is. Okay, question. What age demographic even is Murder Drones? Like... Like, I feel like with the swearing and eldritch horror and also gore, that like... Well, no, they also say like the lower tier swear words, like crap and ass. Uh, the gore is in every episode. Not every episode, but is in a majority of episodes. And I, I remember reading a comment the first time I watched the pilot of, like, they, they made these robots so that they could get away with killing them gruesomely. And then, uh, reading that in the context of murder drone spoilers for the rest of the stream, by the way, <laughs> of what happened to Tessa, and what Sin did, is so funny, because no, no horrible things happened to everyone. Dude, I rewatched, I rewatched re episode 7, and like, the foreshadowing of, uh, no, not seven, episode six. I rewatched episode six, and the foreshadowing of, uh, Tessa being Sid is actually really good. I'll be real, I was one of the people who was like, no, that's just Tessa. There's no way they're pulling the reveal that that is in Tessa. Despite the fact that so many people believed it back when episode six came out. And I was just like, no, there's no way that isn't Tessa. That has to be Tessa.
guys, it wasn't Tessa. Also, N did the smart thing in a horror movie situation of, like, not letting Tessa monologue. Unfortunately, it wasn't actually the smart thing. Is it teleporter time? Look at this healing. Ah! I mean, you can just not be in the healing. Your fungus is ruining the economy. Sin is probably one of my favorite villains ever. Just like the way, just like there's so much dramatic flair, and also the fact that literally until the very end, uh, she did not take any of it seriously. Like she could have killed everyone instantly, but she was like, "No, I'll have some fun," and then regretted that immensely. I'll, I'll be real, my only main question is, like, wh where does Sin end and the Absolute Solver begin? at the moment, as if we're gonna get any more lore. Yeah, so I think that my personal interpretation is that Sin, uh, Solver is the program itself, and Sin is the artific- is the, like, personality that took it over. Also, I'll be real. The end credit scene, I didn't watch that the first time. Because I, like, I was watching Murder Drones before school, and so I had to, like, stop pretty soon after it ended. Uh, should we, are we going? Yeah. So, um, so I, I originally didn't see the post credit scene. And then I heard everyone talking about the post credit scene, and I was like, huh. What happens in the post credit scene? And then I saw. Might as well, yeah. Well. Oh, it will never have another episode. There's not a season two. Like, the, cre the creator himself has said, nope, not making a second season. The story I've wanted to tell is done. Oh my god, you know it would be an amazing Risk of Rain mod? A uh, Sin as a survivor. Dude, I... 
there are people I want to show the final fight, the, like, the fight scene in episode 8 to. But, like, I can't, because I also want them to experience the show blind, and the fight scene in season 8 is, like, the most spoilery thing you could ever watch about the show. Song is a banger. Anyone who hasn't seen the song, uh, look up, uh, on YouTube, just look up Screw You, but have, like, a, f but put a free instead of the E in Screw. No, it, it's, it's a night, it's a nightcore version of a song. Do, do you know about nightcore? Oh, it's a way of editing, like, pre-existing songs into a different, like, into, like, the Nightcore genre, which is more or less just speeding it up, but, like, there's some other effects, I think. Yeah, it's the Nightcore version of the song. You can actually listen to the original version of the song. Uh, I, did, I, don't, I don't know where they posted it, but I know that the original un-Nightcore, like, version of the song before it was Nightcore has been posted. Oh my god, I need to send you the J gif, I think. There's a gif of J where it's the, uh, nah, I'd win meme, and then just her corpse. Dude, they did dolls so dear. They did dolls so dirty. I think my number one actual complaint with the show is that there wasn't- I, I feel like they didn't do enough with Doll. Especially considering she had abilities we saw no one else use. Like, no one else used the dash ability that she had. And she never used it in a fight scene. Ev- okay, everyone reanimates from the dead in that show. No, but I'm- you know what I mean. Anyway, uh, I don't know if Doll coming back from the dead is canon. Cause like, the credit- the- like, all of the credit scenes that aren't the post-credit scene are questionably canon. Anyway, Dibs, I really want Brilliant Behemoth. Doll? I- I- I call Dibs cause I want a Brilliant Behemoth. I don't- I don't remember her getting her head blown off, but you know what, I believe you. Okay. I mean, Jay got her head blown off. N got his head blown off. Okay, you know who my- You know who my favorite villain is, actually? And who I do wish we got a bit more time with, but I think was perfect in the time that she got? Alice. Alice was probably one of the scariest, like, parts of Murder Drugs. Like, so sadistic. Also, Alice's design is just really good, like... Like, the antlers... Uh, screw you with three instead of an E.
Just, just tagging it so I can know what its price is. Wait, hang on. Next one of us to get a green item gets a star. And then we open it and we each get one legendary. I want some. I see. Alright, we 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 hunt for a green item. My, my turret summoning circle. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. I don't think it's Bite Me. I think Bite Me is actually a different song in the Murder Drone soundtrack. Hang on, pause the game. I see. Here's the thing. Uh, the Murder Drone soundtrack has always been a banger. Not bang- like, the names of it has always been bangers. Alright, unpause it. I couldn't find it. I don't- I'll find out what the name is after this run. Damn it. I was wrong. I will never- Why did I think it was screw you? For, uh, you can make an Ahoy Drone with this. Actually, wait, I'll deliver it, because you, uh, because I don't use my equipment as much. Actually, okay, okay, scan? Understandable. Have a great day. I won't fall down, you need me. Yippee! Another one just... Yeah, no, that's where I am. I won't fall down either.
I might make a Bite Me cover. I plan on starting to make covers of songs. I might make one for Bite Me. Or, um, I don't remember the name of the song, but the song from the end of episode 6. The, uh, Can you set me free? Will you take my soul away? Uh, yeah, wait, did you get a, uh, yes, hell yeah. Alright, I would get a Dio's best friend, but I think Brilliant Behemoth would help me out more. It's going to- it's a literal lifesaver. Yeah, that was unfortunate. Alright, teleporter time? I got the wrong item. That song has been taking up room in my head for too long. Oh my god, that was in 2023, wasn't it? Do, do you know what I'm talking about, though? Don't... By the way, just for anyone who might be in chat and needs this advice. Don't respond to serious allegations by pulling out a ukulele and singing a song called Toxic Gossip Train. What was an accident? Where am I? I have my scanner right now. The Booyah drone was around. I don't know where the Booyah drone is, actually. Is it dead? No, it's not dead. I still see it. Oh, it's right next. Oh, it is a boot. It's a no, it still has the trophy hunter. It, it hasn't used its equipment yet. I... So, look, as soon as you started the teleporter event, I basically teleported down, like, to the layer below. Oh, I know. If you play Engineer and you don't use the, uh, st stationary turrets combined with Fungus, you're not playing Engineer. Engineer? Yeah, I'm Engineer and my fucking limit! Do you want this, or...? And his music was electric. Alright. Don't look, remember, don't look at the new, don't look at the new, don't look at the new. I wonder if turrets target the new. I'm not gonna test it, but I just, I wonder. Alright. Quick run, in and out. I mean, I'm not getting anything, so... Yeah, no, because I'm not, I'm not playing as, like, Commando. Flask is actually bait borderline useless for, it, for Engineer. I'm ready.
mods exist for a reason. Oh, altar of gold. We can we can go green this time. Whoa. I poison. Oh hell yeah! Parentheses, oh hell no. I hate the constructs, I hate the constructs, I hate the constructs. God, I love how when there aren't any enemies around, me and the turrets kind of just chill. Shrine of the Mountain King. The unregistered uh, sequel to to uh, Hall of the Mountain King. Parasite dealt with. All right, I'm gonna be over there to try and get a plasma shrimp. Alright, we can't do that yet, because we haven't activated the altar yet. Uh, I actually don't see any Void Cradles, so... Mm, sure. I'm trusting you'll be able to deal with this if I die. Actually, even if I die, my turrets will still be there, so... Alter Golden. You know what sucks? About the Lice Saints now it lets you create one more turret, but then after that you can only create a, a maximum of three, no matter what. Like, you can increase your maximum, but only once. Alright, I'm gonna set up my turrets here. Oh, it, it gives you an extra secondary attack. Oh, uh, the light, not secondary. The secondary, the secondary is my spider mines. No, here's the thing, I can get more charges, it's just that the maximum is still free. Like, that I can have at once. Things always die. You, you look at things and they die, and my turrets kill things. Yeah, well, meet my turrets, they do that. Yippee! Uh, tell me when we shall begin. Oh, hell yeah. Same. Alright, uh, by the way, you can get a titanic neural from the... Yes. Sure, it's fine. I'm sure it's fine. Parentheses, it's not fine. <laughs> you know what? I uh, honestly, I think that the turrets will make up for it. Oh, um, yeah, sure. Ooh, there's another yellow. Can I have it? So, 
The thing about me getting titanic neurals that I just realized is that it also means that the turrets themselves don't die as easily. Like, these turrets are borderline invincible at this point, as long as they're close together. Can you set me free? Will you take my soul away? Dancing in the dark. What do those do? Oh, nice. Oh, I should get some of those. Yeah, I think I have enough bungus at this point. Let's do this. Let's bungus! Wait, I'm bungused? I instinctually scrolled down. Oh, no, I have enough Bungus. I'm just saying I am a Bungus fan. Yeah. I'm just saying, late I'm Bungus is an objectively funny statement. No one can convince me otherwise. If you try to convince me, you're just objectively wrong. And I will be seeing you in court. Let's see if we can get a green portal here. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Now I'm going to use the scanner to make sure. Yeah, no green. for you. Alright, let's hope we can find a Hellcrunch Shrine. Are you ready, kids? Back to the rec room days of placing mines on the fl on the uh, flag and capture the flag. <laughs> that was unironically such an evil thing that you could do. Oh wow! Wait, it actually carries the mines upward. Oh. Oh, 
Oh dear. Look, look at how quickly it filled up. I, I did kind of figure that, but I assume we only get the portal if it charges all the way, right? Oh, well, we might as well charge it. No! Okay, that turret getting frozen just had my life flashing before my eyes. The fact that that's a possibility terrifies me. Oh, yeah. I think I've got enough greens. I unironically don't know what to do with them. This is a this is a white. Let me just. All right. Okay. So this is a green. I'm gonna turn it into a fuel cell. You run into that. All right. And now Dio's best friend. Welcome to Risk of Rain. Sorry, screaming. Are you ready? Damn. Alright, let's do this. I'll be real. What? Uh oh. No! No! Chef, right? Alright. I'm just gonna go to the portal. Teleport or whatever. And just set up there. And from... Oh, sure, but if I- if it's too far away, you can have it and turn it into, like, a soldier syringe or something. Sure. I swear there was- the teleporter was over here. Oh, that seemed pretty far. I'll be re I I'll be real. I I I really want to play the Alan Wake franchise, but Alan Wake Two being Epic Games launcher exclusive is really like. Though, I can't stream it from console. At least not easily. Is... You know, it seems like fun, especially with the DLCs having to do with, like, Jesse Fademan. Faden. Yeah. I think they're just other characters in the Alan Wake universe. No, one of them is one of the game directors for Alan Wake. From what I've seen.
I mean, she appears in the main story, I think. On, like, a TV. And I think that's just such a fun little detail, because, like, that she also appears on that TV in control. Oh, I almost activated the teleporter itself instead of the, uh... I'm terrified. I'm... Alright, I'm actually gonna reset my drones so that they get their armor-piercing rounds I have just gotten. I will. Uh, here's the thing, though. Before I play Alan Wake 2, I need to play Alan Wake 1. Alright, I'm ready. Actually, quick note. Um, I know that the Federal Bureau of Control is at least somewhat involved in Alan Wake 2. How involved is it? Oh, can I, can I get the, uh... Can I hit this one? Alright, but like, I, I mean like, oh my god, there's two green I, I mean, yellow items. Sure. Yeah, but I mean like, just how much of the story does the FBC actually matter to? have, like, the service weapon or any of her abilities from Control, and it's like, doesn't this chronologically take place before Control? Like, she gets those, I, she gets those abilities in Control. Literally, what do you want? Oh, she would, wouldn't she? I, I forgot she was on the run for a while. Alright, I'm ready. I'm here to chew ass and kick bubblegum, and I'm all out of ass. ready. I'm just- I need to get over there and place my drones. Feather. 
17 armor piercing rounds. Terrifying. Engineer? Yeah, I'm Engineer and my fucking planet. They love that quote so much. That's the Celestia. Option? No. But that, yeah, in the logbook, yeah. Kill him. Hell yeah. Oh, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do that, because the, I don't- the, the, uh, the turrets don't- Well, yeah, but like I'll, I'll, I might kill the other guy. Like I might kill the other guy before I kill the Halcyon Sea with the turrets. I don't know. Yeah, no, I know, I just, I'm, sorry, I'm a bit slower than you right now. Oh, no! No, wait, yes, maybe? I can't tell. Because I'm, I'm, I'm low down right now. Unfortunately. Oh, no, there are still enemies here. Thank you. Alright. Hey, Locke, can you help me find the pathing? Like, I don't know where to go. Yeah, that's what I, that's why I'm asking. Lock, I think I die if I leave this area. All right, all right, I'm ready. Hi, which, where do I go? Okay, I'm gonna try to follow you. I think. Uh, no, my main issue here is the meteorites. Ah! Oh, right, Dio's best friend. I genuinely forgot I had that. I was so full of rage for a second there. Uh, I... Probably, but let's be on the safe side. Yep, I'm on my way. Just, um, placing the 
basically I'm placing a, a turret every couple steps so that like I don't care what I don't I don't even care if that's a lit actually if it was a lit I would go for it, but yeah. Alright. Okay, these turrets are cool as hell though. But, 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 I was out of turret area for that. So during the boss, as long as I'm in turret zone, I should be fine. Uh. You know what? My greens aren't doing that much for me. I almost misclicked. Yeah, no, I, I know that they are, but I, I'm not actually using the green items for much, honestly. And they weren't very useful. Yeah. And the infusions have already done their what they're supposed to, which makes it unfortunate that neither of them got used. Sorry, I'm so slow. <laughs> I could. Should I? You know what? I'm getting another Dio's best friend. You can never have enough best friends. Uh-oh. Alright, well, goodbye double jump. I probably didn't need you. Okay. Wait, hear me out. I have- I might have two min- I- I might have just enough bungus that I can s sacrifice three of them. It's worth it. This- that was worth it. I think, for the ability to cancel out fall damage. Alright. Yeah. You know- Two DLCs end the base game, and I have yet to see it rain once. Let alone have it be a risk. Alright, I'm ready. It is, but where's the rain? Dude, stop damaging me in the cutscene, you bad game. <laughs> Not a hypocrite, by the way. So when does the seed appear? By the way, that was the second phase. Tell me when I need to stop killing it so I can relocate my turrets. Okay, wait, my abilities are gone. Oh dear lord! No, false sun, no, no, no! I literally don't have abilities so I can't relocate my drones. False sun, stop dying. Oh hell yeah. Yeah. Thank God. Now what? We can what? Oh, you activated the portal, though. Let's go to the hatchery.
Oh, it's this area. Alright, wanna kill Mifrix? Okay, we're not doing this today, but I do want to point out that it is possible to, um... It's possible to fight all three final bosses in one run. Which is horrifying. You, uh, you want to fight Voidling after Mifrix? You know what? That's funny. Let's do that. Uh, want to go straight to the teleporter? Yeah, I, so did I. And now... I can get the other skins without having to worry about the Hellcon, the Hakon seed. I can get the new alternate commander. Oh, Shrine of the Mountain. Okay, I'm just gonna place my guys. Gone, reduced to atoms. Honestly terrifying. Oh, dear lord. No, instead of infinite... Yeah, exactly, he has the fuel cells. I'm gonna get a red whip. Just for the sake of, like, getting around faster. God, I've had, um, Shawnee's Charming Chaos Compendium stuck in my head for a while, honestly. Uh, do you know about that one? What up, motherfuckers? You ever heard anyone lose a mind on my... Child murder. Somehow not the worst crime we've committed in Risk of Rain. I don't remember. What is that one? Oh. I mean, I'm pretty sure... Does blowing up the moon count as Omnicide? I am ready. God, I feel so bad for the dr for the turrets. The soundtrack guy cooked again, by the way. Like for the DLC. You didn't see anything. No, you didn't. You didn't see anything. <laughs> nope, they never existed, Locke. They, they never existed, Locke. Find a way to rescue the ship. No. I mean, even if you did, I would need to get up there as well, so... Please don't do that. Um... Okay, what- how many void- I mean, how many coins do you have? Alright, can you pet the glass frog this time? Remember, you have to pet it t Uh, 73. Yeah, basically... Not many, I just haven't been getting many back after the tragedy of me refreshing the shop 20 times. 
Um... Yeah, I didn't realize until too late that every time you refresh the shop, it takes twice as many. Do not die! That's not good news! Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm terrified now, because I have two of them. You know what? I think it just de it just depends on what items we get back first. And also, I don't know if they take your turret items, so I'm sure the turrets can just... You know what I think one of the biggest missed opportunities with the DLC was, honestly? The fact that the survivors added in the DLC don't have the alternate skins that they like. They don't have the alternate skins for beating the DLC boss like every other survivor has. Like, that's just kind of dumb. Altar of Blood? Light work, no reaction. I mean, honestly, I feel like to the risk of rain community, that's not very impressive. They do some insane things. No, I did two, uh, Pillars of Blood. Alright, hear me out. Do not go into the arena too quickly, so I can just set up the, uh, turrets instantly before Mithrix even spawns. I think that's a funny idea. I will. God, I barely make it up. The one time I'm glad that it doesn't just t instantly teleport people up. Alright, I'm ready. This is- this is gonna be so funny, because it's gonna take damage from you shocking it, and from the turrets shooting it. Yeah, no, I doubt Mif- I- I- we might be able to kill Mifrix in the cutscene. Not even close. Okay, my turret's Dio's best friend's just activated. That's a bad sign. All three of them at once from Mithrix's shockwave, so I have to keep in mind that his shockwave just needs to kill them. And actually, I'm gonna resummon them all now, because that also resets their Dio's best friends. Yeah, no, I've resummoned them already. Yeah, no, it's really fast to resummon them if you have the charges.
Oh god. I do remember. I mean, I might have screwed him over because I have two Dio's best friends. Okay, resummoning the drones immediately so they have their Dio's best friends back because also they don't get their items stolen. Oh, wait, they do get their items stolen when I get mine stolen, so... Oh. Alright, it wasn't an issue. Alright, you're, you're gonna pet the frog. I can't believe that's not a hoax. I've never seen something that gives off more hoax vibes. Well, I mean, I'm pretty sure canonically, uh, the guy from Risk of Rain 1 and Mithrix are brothers. Providence? Is that the name of the Risk of Rain 1 guy? I know it starts with P. I really thought Providence was gonna be the guy from, uh... See... Yeah, I really thought False Sun was gonna be Providence. That's... Yep. Uh, honestly, just activate the portal. Like, instantly. Like, don't wait for me to catch up, because I'll be pulled along with you. You know what I- f Okay, so you know subathons, right? If I ever get popular enough to, uh, for a subathon, my- It's probably gonna be, like, a Risk of Rain 2 all endings thing. And so, do you want to know what I mean by all endings? Every survi every survivor has unique text after they beat Mifrix and get and go onto the ship, beat the Voidling and go into the deep void portal, or beat Mifrix and stay behind on the moon when it detonates. Do you know how many that is? Too many. Because there's like. How many survivors are there? I'm trying to think. I think there's like over 20, right? So over 20 survivors times 3, that's over 60 endings. That is the kind of thing I would never do outside of a sub stream. So, hey, people watching, share, share uh, my Twitch channel with your friends if you want to see me suffer. I placed my turrets too far away for them to uh, focus on Voidling. Yeah. Unfortunately for the Voidling, you are rapidly approaching its ground. Okay. One turret over here. Oh my god, turrets don't focus Voidling. Oh yes, they do. Okay. I was so worried for a second. God damn. Uh oh. I actually didn't realize you died on False Sun. Alright, well. I guess we're playing this little eternal game. I have three phases or two, I don't remember. Uh-oh. Bad news, I'm going to die. I am very aware of that block. So did I! I really thought we were able to we'd be able to clear Void Voidling, because Voidling is like the easiest boss of the final bosses.
Yeah, I'm gonna mess around. I'm probably gonna, gonna mess around with the new character bit on stream before I end. That's not good. I'm a big fan of characters that are very fast. Can you? Guys, can you focus on Voidling? What is wrong with you? What, what are we doing here? Yeah. Guys, the Voidling is right there. Why are we doing this? I, I'm, I, I'm pretty sure I got it spoiled that it is the False Sun. I don't know how hard that was to guess, if I'm being perfectly honest. Guys, it's right there. Yeah, no, I know. Yeah. I hate my turrets right now. What are you even- Oh my god, it's a jellyfish. You're focus firing a jellyfish right now. Oh. You know what? Thanks for focus firing that jellyfish. I, I never should have doubted you guys. I don't know. And I don't want to know the odds. test that I can't place four. Yeah, I can, unfortunately. Dude, I'm 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 just gonna die, I think. Cause like this is this is a Sisyphean struggle. You're not winning by the way, Void Fiend. I'm letting you win. That doesn't count. Void Link, yeah. Sorry, I unironically get the two confused. If I put them here no. I, I cannot do anything about this. Oh, wait, wait, Voidling is taking damage. Okay, I'm just dying. I, I am unironically sick of this. Oh my god, I'm, I'm still gaining health faster than I can lose it, and I need the Void Feed to actually finish me off, because fall damage isn't fatal in this game. Kill me! What are you doing?! <laughs> it was just doing friendly fire, why is this game doing this to me?! I know, but still... Unironically Sisyphean in nature. Yes. I understand how Sisyphus felt now. Yes! Sweet death! Wait, uh, before I... Before I do that, let me just... Oh, damn, that's actually good. Engineer alt skin is really good. Oh, god, this... Okay. 
Let's do a non... Let's just do a quick test. For, I'm just gonna do a quick test of how good this guy is. Uh, understandable, let me, uh... Okay. So... Okay. Question. Is, uh, is the artifact of rebirth where you get the items? So, if you don't use the artifact of rebirth, can you just, like, store a bunch of items? Oh, this is... Oh, this is horrible. Oh, I'm never playing this guy. <laughs> Unironically, only gonna play this guy potentially for the mastery achievement, because I want the mastery achievement for every character at some point. Oh, gosh! You know what? Movement ability kind of makes up for it. This guy does not feel like a survivor. I know, exactly, that's what I mean, is that it just feels like they took the boss, which doesn't really... You know what? Maybe it's not as bad as I thought. Oh wait, I have Paul's go, go hoof, that's why it's not as bad as I thought. Alright, what, uh, what skill do I need to kill with in order to get the... to kill 15 enemies with to get the... Alright, uh... Oh god. Wanna, like, die and then we can put it to monsoon mode? Yeah, that's a good point, actually. Never mind, let's not do monsoon. Alright. Hang on, let me see. How many am I parading around? That's four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten. Oh, Eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14. Fourteen. Oh, that's fifteen. Alright, I'm actually gonna wait for a bunch of them to group up more than- Cause I already think I have fifteen, but I wanna be super sure. I love them. The beetles are so silly. No, one of them was glacial, so it interrupted the... One of them was glacial, so it interrupted the ability. Lock? I'm so mad. Did you hear what happened? I think this is 15. Oh my god, I... It doesn't do much damage. I'm just gonna try to hit each of them once. No, nope, I'm just killing them. 
Alright, I think it's best if we make this a, uh, single-player thing. Because then we can each get the items we need without having to compete for them, I guess. What items are you using, by the way? Alright, I have focus crystals, because I feel like those would be really helpful. I thought that that would go the direction I was moving, not the direction I was facing. Which I think, looking back, is was a stupid thought, but... Okay, yeah, the movement ability is okay. I'll be real. I kind of love the DLC, but the survivors they added are not good. Like, Chef Seeker and the uh, False Sun all suck. And that's unfortunate. I, I think the only thing Seeker has going for her is the fact that she has that, like, Helldivers 2 <laughs> revival thing. Tell me I'm wrong. Tell me that isn't Helldivers 2. Are you 15? Is this 15 Beatles? I can ironically can't tell. I thought there was only four beetles! Get it? Oh, hell yeah. Yeah. Just got focus crystals and annihilated them. Okay, you know what I think uh, another issue I have with the DLC survivors is? I want to say, I love the DLC, I hate the survivors in it. <laughs> is how little unlockable abilities they have. I think one of my favorite parts of Risk of Rain 2 is the unlockable abilities. And none of the DLC survivors have more than one unlockable, unlockable ability. Uh, for this DLC. Yeah, sure. Honestly, I might hop into single player to test it out, but we can stay and call while I do. Oh wait, False Sun has a... No, False Sun doesn't have... Wait, yeah, False Sun has a passive. Oh, that's actually kinda cool. Wait, that's a really cool passive. Basically, uh, you know the secondary where you shoot out the Lunar Spikes? Uh, the more Lunar Spike... Yeah, the more Lunar Spike charges you have left, the more... Like, da the, like more stats you have. Okay. Honestly, the alternate doesn't seem that good. It's kind of just the same, but without a charge up, and so I and I and uh, not as sustained. So it's it's just instant instead of the having the charge up and then. Hang on, but it might pierce. Yep, 
Seeker only has one unlockable ability, and Chef only has one unlockable ability. I hope they had more unlockable abilities for these characters, because I feel like they deserve them. You know what, everyone? Before I... Uh, before I end stream, I'm gonna try out a, pr a prismatic trial. Uh, with mercenary. Just, let's see what the prismatic trial is today. I'm not trying this, pris this prismatic trial today. Uh, goodbye everybody. <laughs> God, sometimes you encounter a prismatic trial and it's just like, that is not worth it. Anyway, bye everybody.